Hey guys, this is Call Me Jeremy with another quick tutorial here. Uh, this one is in response to a Reddit TF2 question on just exactly how you disable the Steam synchronization inside a TF2. So I know sometimes you'll get uh, config files that are all messed up and you just can't seem to fix them because it keeps syncing up to the cloud. So that's what this is going to be about. So first what we're going to do is we're going to open Steam as you can see here. You go down to your Team Fortress 2. You right click on it, click on properties, and then we go to the updates tab. And then you make sure that under Steam Cloud, this is unchecked. The one that says enable Steam synchronization for Team Fortress 2. Once you uncheck that, you go ahead and click on close, and then you go ahead and click on play to start Team Fortress 2. And this is going to take a few seconds to load up here because I'm running it on my laptop. All right, so now we got Team Fortress 2 up. What we want to do is we want to click right here in the Options tab that the Overlay button is so nicely hiding from us right now. All right, so here it is. Click on the Options button. We go all the way over to the Multiplayer tab. And then we click on the bottom here where it says Advanced. And then we scroll about midway down and there will be an area right here. Oh, I guess it's all the way at the bottom. So we scroll all the way to the bottom and un make sure this is unchecked. Synchronize with the Steam Cloud. Make sure it's unchecked. You click OK. And just for good measure, we're going to click Apply and OK. Then we're going to go ahead and quit TF2. Now, uh, if you want to delete all your configs and get all brand new configs, you just pull up Windows Explorer and you go to program files uh, x86 if you've got a 64 bit Steam, Steam Apps, your username, Team Fortress 2, TF, and then this entire config folder here. You can go ahead and delete this one right here. So you delete that and then you'll restart Team Fortress 2 and it'll say, hey, I don't have any configs. Uh, I've got to recreate the, the basic ones. And then there you go. You're, you're good to go. Uh, you'll have all the basic configs and you can recreate them all you want and then you just reverse these steps to re-enable cloud synchronization and it'll sync up your new changes to the cloud uh, I've noticed that if you do all of this in the same day or within the same hour even sometimes that it won't take uh, I think there's a expiration time limit with uh, the steam cloud stuff so usually I'll wait until the next day before I enable cloud synchronization once more to really make sure that it takes my new changes and uploads them to the cloud and it doesn't download my old changes. So that's just a quick TF2 uh, tutorial there on disabling the cloud synchronization. Hope you enjoy and hope it clarifies some things. This is uh, Call Me Jeremy and I'll see you in game.